Shadows. Hello. Off today. Woodhill Park. We're in the dog field at the moment. We're walking on the coast. And we go to West Runton, is it? West Runton. Yes, West Runton. Beeston Hill. Sherringham. If you're walking from West Runton to Sherringham, West Runton Car Park, it goes through several caravan sites. And uh, it's a permissive path, so you just keep to the cliff edge. This is Laburnum Caravan Park, but you may walk through. And uh, they do take tourers, and they're just on the front row. There's like two small rows of them. The rest are like permanent chalets. Now, just entering Beast and Regis Holiday Park. It's another big site. They started taking a few tourists, but it's mainly um, chalet type things. And that's Beast and Hill coming up. All we can smell is bacon cooking breakfast. Well, we've had bacon. Yeah, we've had bacon, but we've had it in, in rolls. But this is. Uh, Beeston Regis and that's Beeston Hill but they locally call it Beeston Bump. Yes, yeah they never used to have this did they? No, this is fairly new. Normally you can get down to the beach from this site for the residents but they've closed it off because uh, they've, they've had the cliffs here collapse quite a few times. Yeah, the vans are. You can see how close the vans are there. It's gone down, is it? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh, yeah. It's all slid down. It's collapsed. Yeah. This is where the steps are. You can see it's washing it away. It's blocked off. Yes, see there's been a landslide there. Yeah, not good. Yeah, yeah. But the van's there. Yeah, they rebuilt this recently and it's collapsed. Yeah. Beast and bump. Right, that's where we just come from, right in the distance, over there, National Trail, part of the English Coastal Path. Wait for a little old me. Oh. This bit's hot because there's no breeze. Still going up. Oops. A rucksack feels about three times heavier coming up here. right up there. Getting there. That's Sherringham down there. Well, first part is Beeston Regis there. And the main is uh, Sherringham. up the steam train from here called the poppy line and it goes all the way to Holt that's 
where we came from. Hello Jane. Are you alright? It's a struggle, won't it? Have a look at the sea. People have had their ashes sprinkled up here. There's like three memorial bits with flowers on. It's lovely. We've been up in here in the snow <laughs> on one of our holidays. Right. Beeston Hill and X. Uh, sorry, a Y station linking in with Bletchley Park during the war and it was a direction finding facility and there's Y stations all the way around the coast right down to Plymouth and Scarborough intercept code information which is sent to Bletchley Park by dispatch rather than teleprinter. Once decoded, they took taken place. The dispatch riders took the messages to the war office in London. Going down the steps now, and that's sharing on. That's where we're going. I think it'll be coffee somewhere. It's always coffee. If you walk down here, you know, and jump off this step, it's the end of the world because it's flat, you know. The colour again. Oh no, steps, I forgot. Yeah, loads of steps. There we go. It's lovely, isn't it? We're at Sherryham Museum at the moment, and I think we're going up the steps. It's Granny. Sharingham. And we might end up at the theatre for coffee. Not sure yet. <laughs> We're now in the theatre cafe at Sheringham and um, we've both got a small piece of cake. <laughs> Is that alright for you? Delicious. Well, I was hoping to take some pictures of the steam train, but unless you've got a ticket, you're not even allowed on the station. So we won't be coming here again. We've just walked all this way to look at the trains, and we can't see the trains. Uh, can't even sit in the garden like we used to. Yeah, we used to sit in the garden just down here, and you can't get in. Oh bugger. <laughs> We're walking down the boulevard from the railway station. We could smell and see the smoke from the steam trains. We did try and get on the platform but the, you've got to have a, a ticket. Threw us off. Threw us off basically. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So we're a bit um, off with Sheringham because we've walked all this way to look at the trains and we can't. Well Jane's swimming in the sea with that on and I'm in my trunks and I've been swimming. There's Jane. Sorry? Yeah, it's all right, isn't it? <laughs> You're into the sun, I can't see you. <laughs> Come this way.
you're into the wives now. Yes, here comes the wives. Yeah, you're into the you're into the wives. Yes, I have been swimming. I haven't got a waterproof case for the camera. So I don't want to get too wet. Come on in, let's have a close up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're all right. He said it's going out, so you, yeah. you, within the hour he said you, you're better. The chalk spits there, it's yeah. beyond the chalk, yeah. is the stones. But uh, come on then, let's have a. Go uh, get down in the water. <laughs> First time for First time in many years. Yeah. It's like 18 minutes of the Yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's water. Oh. Actually, it's not too bad. No, it's not, is it? It's when you first get in. Yeah. yeah. Oh. I'm just bobbing about, just swimming up to the water break. We've got to be a bit careful at Sheringham because beyond the chalk mark, the white is rocks so this is and it's going out at the moment there's some big waves coming in now James got a hat on because he don't want to get hair wet. I haven't got any hair, but I'll probably check. <laughs> yeah. Stopping at the um, Crown for lunch, fish pie, and vegetables. And we're both a bit damp from swimming and exhausted. <laughs> And this is at the very end of Sheringham, near the museum. It's called the Crown. Just in the gentlemen's toilets, where the boys hang out in the pub. Hi, big boy. On our way back now to uh, Woodhill Park. A slow walk back. Going to go along the beach on the way back. Hopefully. Sorry? It's very slow. Very slow walk back. Yeah. Can't believe. This is last of the beach huts at Sheringham. And what a clean beach. I don't think I've seen a spot of rubbish anywhere. Have you? Absolutely spotless. It's a strange beach because you've got from when the, the tide's in, it's all sand to swim in but when you get to the chalk that's when the rocks start and when the, so you you're better swimming when the uh, tides in that's what chap was saying anyway and then you get a big lump like that i think that's a dinosaur dropping yes it looks like a it's like a giant dog dropping thing, long, elongated. Look. Sea defences almost completely washed away. And only just standing. And only just. Well, we just managed to have an ice cream. And sit down. And almost back at the campsite, just got this ridge to go over now. Then there'll be the dog walking field for the campsite, and then we'll be back at Herb. There's the sea over there. Blue, look at blue sky, a bit of fluffy clouds. Yeah. And you can see the hordes of white vans, and we're amongst that lot. But it looks busier than what it really is. There's a fair few empty spaces. 